welcome to my new channel. I think I'm going to be calling it Pipes and Bikes. Uh, mainly it's derived of two, uh, two big likes of mine. One, smoking pipes, and the other one, riding bikes. So, ask a question, can you ride a pipe, uh, sorry, can you ride a bike and smoke a pipe? Stay tuned and we'll find out at the end of the video. Today, I'm smoking uh, some Borkham Riff. A uh, little bit of a mixture of my own uh, today. I've got a little bit of the uh, what's left of the uh, Borkham Riff Ruby. That's a really good uh, cherry sort of flavour. And uh, I sort of bulked the rest up with uh, Borkham Riff Bronze. Very, very good smoke, like now, it's sort of like a, a whiskey bourbon sort of flavour to it, like now. So it's like a cherry bourbon. Very nice. I'm a member of uh, Pipe Smokers North East on, uh, on Facebook and uh, we get together, well, well we try to get together uh, once a month on a Saturday and to a local brick and mortar store uh, based in Newcastle here and uh, you know get together have a good old chin while I talk about the pipes, the tobacco, experiences. Uh, smoking a pipe can be quite sultry at times so it's good to go to these pipe meetings now and again and uh, have a good old chin wag with uh, other people like with like-minded uh, people. Again, uh, the people that was on uh, yesterday in a pipe meet, um, there was uh, Cobbett, Cobbett of the Shire, he was there, another YouTuber, and uh, North East Piper UK. Uh, go, by all means, go and visit their videos, ask them a question if you need be, or likewise, if, if you want to ask me a question, feel free. If I, if I can answer it, I will. If I can't answer it, or don't know, I'll endeavour to find out the answer and get back to you. As you can tell this is, probably, this is my first uh, YouTube video. First of many I hope, many more to come. Um, yeah, and uh, a little bit nervous, but uh, so far so good. Huh? Smoking in uh, a Mr. Brock pipe. Uh, it's number 51 Amigo, and uh, it's made of pear wood. First pear wood pipe I've had. Uh, usually I go with the uh, the briar woods, or red, uh, I always go to the default to see uh, the Cobbs, Missouri Musham. Very good pipes indeed. Such good smoke. So the price you pay for for uh, Mr. Brock pipe, even if you get you're just getting into getting into it, you get an absolute quality pipe for a fraction of the price. And as we were discussing yesterday in uh, the the monthly pipe meet, it's not about the the, the price of the pipe. It's it's not how good the smoke is. I've had I've got a uh, Peterson Dublin pipe, and. Uh, it smokes alright, it's good, it's a system pipe. But I always tend to go to a cob. The cob sm sm smokes slightly better uh, than the expensive Peterson in Dublin. But uh, yeah. this Mr. Brock pipe, this is a happy medium, medium, medium between two, absolutely fantastic smoke. A good size weight, a good weight to it. And uh, I'll be adding more Mr. Brock pipes to my collection. But, uh, for now, we'll, we'll cut into a video. Um, apologies for the, the quality; it was done off my, uh, my phone uh, of the pipe meet yesterday. Pipe, uh, pipe smoking northeast, and Cobb of the Shire was there. 
a quick little video and uh, the audio I don't think is not very good but we'll cut to that now. Well here I am in uh, my local uh, brick and mortar uh, currently smoking a Mr. Brog uh, pipe it's a number 51 Amigo uh, really nice smoke and uh, it's made from hairwood I believe and uh, it's going to be part of our uh, annual Mr. Brog pipe giveaway uh, which will be next month in our meet in October October 6th I think we're arranging the date for uh, it may shift slightly left to right uh, for one of our members to make it uh, but with me today currently we have uh, Corbett of the Shire Hi. and we have Northeast Piper UK over there uh, please go on to the, the, the YouTube channels like and subscribe if you haven't already and uh, going back to the studio and there we have it folks we have uh, our first video in our brick and mortar hopefully we'll get permission might be able to do a, a bit, bit more about the store uh, and help support uh, our local store as well The pipe I was smoking there in, in, uh, in the previous video was this pipe. A bit closer. It is a Mr. Brog. Let the camera will get into focus. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, it's a nice little blue bit with a, uh, a little slight little bent to it. And it's got a nice little uh, cart engraving on the bottom there. I don't know if you can see that very clear, clearly. Different, and it sits flat on the desk on the, the tabletop as well. So if you do, if you have a rest for a minute or two, stick it on there. I'll add uh, a link into the description to Mr. Brock Pipes and uh, to our Facebook page. Um, tune in, stay tuned for next month because we'll be doing a Mr. Uh, what do we call it? It'll be the official annual Mr. Brock Meeting Northeast. So we're doing this every year with the kind commission of Mr. Brock. We'll be uh, donating some of his pipes and uh, we'll be raffling them off. Uh, as giveaways on uh, on YouTube and be drawn the tickets or, uh, or drawn names and everything like that from uh, our next meet which will be on the Saturday 6th of October hope you can make it there if you want to know where details if you want to make it uh, to our pipe meet uh, pop us a message I'll, uh, I'll be making an uh, email address pipes and bikes at gmail.com or message me via YouTube. Talking too much, the pipes keep, keeps going out. And some fantastic pipes will be going out. Um, yeah, so going back to the question can you ride a bike and smoke a pipe at the same time? Let's find out, shall we? Let's cut to the video.
been doing that. Uh, I suppose it is possible, but it's just not practical. So, until then, stay safe and keep her lit. Take care.